Preparation of bacterial smears is necessary before any staining can be done. A smear is a drop of broth or a bit of growth from a plate that is spread as a thin film across a glass slide and allowed to dry. Slides are thin, transparent, rectangular pieces of glass that can fit into a microscope for viewing. The smear is spread on the surface of the slide. To prepare a smear, material is taken from the sample using aseptic technique. This is to prevent contamination of the culture because the slide itself is not sterile. Here, a drop of broth is used to create the smear. The loopful of broth is spread into a circular area about two centimeters in diameter. It is also possible, and in fact preferred, to prepare smears from a culture grown on a solid surface. A drop of water is placed on the slide and then culture from a plate or slant is aseptically transferred to the drop. The culture is emulsified, meaning it's mixed with the drop completely, and then finally spread to make a thin film on the slide and allowed to dry afterward. It is important to wait the full 10 minutes as a wet smear cannot be heat fixed effectively. This is a common mistake for beginning students and results in exploded cells or the microbes not sticking to the surface of the slide. Once dry, the smear is briefly passed through a flame. This melts exopolysaccharide on the surface of the cells, cementing them to the glass. The slide should be passed through the flame for about one half second. Doing it any longer than that can result in poor slides. Heat fixing prevents the microbe from washing off in subsequent staining protocols. After this procedure, the smear is now ready for staining.